How to follow wedding shower etiquette. One of the maid of honor's many responsibilities is leading the planning of a wedding shower. It can be a daunting task, but if you adhere to simple etiquette guidelines, the party can be an elegant success. You will need bride, guests, invitations, registry information, the friend's groom, and a shower theme. Optional, a venue. Step one, take cues from the bride about what she wants, but don't let her end up running the whole shower. This is supposed to be a gift from the maid of honor or bridesmaids to the bride, so ultimately, you make the decisions. Step two, send invitations at least one month in advance. Remember, only invite people to the shower who are already invited to the wedding. Include a card noting where the couple is registered for gifts. If the bride is having more than one shower, make sure to sync up with the other host to be sure there are no guest duplicates. Step three, don't forget the groom. It is traditional for the groom to show up toward the end of the shower and mingle with the guests. These gifts are for him too, after all. Step four, don't expect people to contribute money to you for hosting the bridal shower. It is the responsibility of the host to take on the cost burden. Make the shower budget friendly by hosting at your house and making food instead of hiring a caterer. Step five, choose a theme such as kitchen or bathroom to signal to the guests what kind of gift they should pick out. Make sure to decide the theme and send along that information with the invitation. Step six, leave thank you notes to the bride and groom, the recipients of the gifts. You as the host of the shower are not responsible for thank you cards. Following these etiquette rules is sure to get you a heartfelt thank you of your own. Did you know, as of 2010, between 6,000 and 7,000 couples married each day in the United States.